Dragon Age Inquisition Scene 1 a villager confronts the Inquisitor who is passing through the area. I'm reading for the part of the villager. Oh. If it isn't the Inquisitor, what do you want with us? Trouble? <laughs> I've lost two sons and a sister to this war. Everyone around here has lost someone. Is that trouble enough for you, your worship? You could turn right around and leave the way you came. Doesn't matter. I know you. I know people like you. Playing your games. Sending my boys to fight your battles. When it's all over, do you think it makes a whit of difference who wins? Gaspard or Celine? All the same to us. Down here in the dirt. Just words. It'll be better when the dead come home. Not even the Maker can do that. Dragon Age Inquisition, Scene 2. The Inquisitor is investigating an abduction and trying to get information. The estate was utterly stripped of joy when Lady Rosette disappeared. The Dowager is distraught, hasn't taken supper in days. Days! <gasps> we don't talk like that. It's unthinkable. No, absolutely not. Not dead. Please, we're begging you. The Inquisition has access to resources, information. If anyone could locate Rosette, you can. Look, I have the lady's favorite things. Maybe these will help. Not just any silk pillow. It's filled with honeysuckle and mint. She was quite mad for the blend, and tell your men they might lure her with salted cod, but only on Sundays. She's not just a cat, she's THE cat. Why, when Empress Celine was visiting the chateau, Lady Rosette slept curled around the Empress's head. Tell me, who else has dared embrace the Imperial crown in such a brazen fashion? Who else has been allowed to so use the Empress's own person? Rosette is special, even Celine knows it.